We at ICAFE Sweden are dedicated to build world's fastest, strongest, safest electric unicycles. Here you see the difference between our motor we use at RSX, our mod of uh, big body RS with EX, first generation EX motor, C40. Here it is wide open. You can inspect the differences between in motion, Lipper Kim and Kingston motors. All these motors look the same. This is the latest uh, from in motion V11. All modern uh, motors, C30, C38, I looks like this. The older ones with black um, inner part is uh, and the uh, hub motor, not hollow. Hub motor from um, Lipper Kim and uh, Kingston. Lipper Kim veteran. Sherman and uh, King Song 16X, this one, but they all look the same. Take a look, it's a uh, small copper wire, 30 or 38 millimeters uh, magnets. You see how it's done with, with some. Handmade small copper winding around. It's not much copper, not that much as in, in this one. Just to compare. The diameter of motor, it uh, used to be 25 centimeters. 25 here, 25 on Lipper Kim, Sherman, 25 on uh, in motion V11 30 centimeters on uh, Bigodi EX C40 Another thing it's uh, copper wire windings it's much thicker it's like it's one millimeter thick uh, copper you see how it is and how it's made. It uh, looks much more robust. Totally different construction. It's, it's much more work to build this motor. To compare with, with Sherman. Check the quality of this build. It's the same, same as uh, King Song. The wire thickness on all these motors is like half millimeter against one millimeter from Big Odys C40. Just good to know. So another thing, it's uh, all these motors. It's made for 60, uh, 72 volt. You know, it's uh, now when we use hundred volt architecture, hundred thirty four volt architecture, we cannot use uh, um, motors that built for for sixty or seventy two volts. Uh, I think it's dangerous. So here at iCafe we are working with safety and performance. It goes hand in hand, you know. It has to be a much more safer build. And it um, gives you better performance as well. Uh, with build like this, you can trust your wheel. 
you know, it's <laughs> it's uh, so much torque, so much power. So uh, if you are here uh, in Sweden, riding in all conditions. If you are heavyweight rider, you need wheel that uh, can you can trust, can hold you, and, and um, with such torque wheel you can accelerate uphills. You know. This is how it is. Okay, guys, please like and subscribe.